Yo, what's up? It's your favorite homegirl, Crochet to Go, and we back for another reaction video. I just wrapped up DDG's response to Soul Illuminati. Make sure you check that one out. But we got to keep it going. We got Soul Illuminati's response back to DDG, and this one is called DDG Calls the Industry on Me After Getting Exposed. So we're going to see where this goes. I think I'm going to fit DDG's other response in this too because Soul's video clip here is only four minutes long. So we could just go ahead and consolidate all of this, get the reaction in, kind of see where we're going. I don't feel like this going to last too, too long, this beef between them. I feel like they both have overstated their peace and their grievance. They're making the same points that they've already made and been making about each other. Just, again, different strokes for different folks. Y'all already know I love y'all. Let's get into the video. But before we do, drop that intro. Oh, brother. All right, here we go. Soul's response. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just call and just see. <laughs> Hello. The red emoji. Hey, um, I got a quick question. Um, yeah, what's up? So this, this very mean person made a, uh, <laughs> a YouTube video about me, but he put this, wait, wait, this. Look, look at this industry puppet speaking to one of his masters. Whoa. Very mean person made a. Uh, a YouTube video about me, but he put way too petty as a sound in the video. We can claim it, right? Uh, we should be able to. Yeah, if he used if he used the sound, do you know how many how much of the song he used? Yeah, he used he used a decent amount. I, can't you just do it because it's fair use, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It should be claimed by Sony Music. Okay, I'm gonna send you the link after this. So we can make money off of it. <laughs> okay. I love it. Yeah, send me the link. All right. Okay, bye. Uh, uh, he just got the biggest views of his life. I'm finna take it away. Why he talking about views? Twitch so is my third channel. LOL. So where you at with the? He just it, this is like a clip. It's definitely a TikTok clip. He just reacting and adding commentary. Let me make sure I tune in, pay attention for some of this now. Now listen. And he used way too petty. Nature so in the building. Gang sir, gang sir in the building, man. Simple. Hey, listen. This man, some way, somehow, I dropped a video talking about his girl. I dropped a video talking about him, him as a person. And some way, somehow, he made the entire thing still, like I told y'all, about money. It's either money, jewelry, cars, clothes. Which one is it? Motherfucking sprinklers turned on while I was out here trying to go crazy high vibrations good energy mm -hmm. but listen it come to a point he can't even respond notice he called the industry and he asked them can you please take the video down or can i please make money off the vid do you notice out of everything i said about him exposed him i cussed i said disney exposed all type of shit in the vid if you reacted to the vid you notice it wasn't monetized it was no ads on the vid I was gonna say that. I was gonna say that. Like, I was like, am I tripping? Is Soul's channel not monetized? Did he not monetize the video? Or was this a fluke for me? No ads. Because you see, DDG video was gonna eat us up with the ads. That's why, I, like I said, I gotta get YouTube Premium to continue these reactions. But I did notice that Soul's video didn't have any ads in it. <laughs> The video was demonetized the first 20 seconds. There was never any ads on the video. Checkmate. They see, that's what I'm saying. They are both playing their own game. They're both playing their own game. So is, again, you had to call somebody else to ask for permission of something that you should own or that you own but again once you sign to labels once you go higher up in certain things you're not the only partner even for your own intellectual property so you do got to be careful with that but at the same time to ddg point it's in the video i i need that that's my coin but then the checkmate there weren't even any ads so he right. So's right. Claim it. Take it. Here. It's still on the internet. No one's getting paid for it. 
No answer in the video. Gotcha. <laughs> there was no ads on the bid. It was no ads on the bid to begin with. Both of these dudes are pure comedy. I'm telling you, they both got me dying laughing at their responses. For the viewer that don't know, this is my third channel. I'm not doing none of this for the money. The video was demonetized. I couldn't get paid for it anyway. All my videos get demonetized, just like my second channel. Look, this is all the videos. Some of us don't do Dang. this shit for money. Some of us actually come on here and expose and shit, man. He making a point yet again. It's like to each his own. I guess some would say if you don't make money from YouTube, how do you make your money? But that's none of our business here or there unless he decides he wants to share it. But if all your videos are getting demonetized, then, I mean, at the end of the day, you are showing your receipts that you're doing it solely out of kindness of your heart, purely. <laughs> For the content and again as a fellow content creator i love co creating content but i also want to make some coins too it ain't gotta be the million million me i love to be the million million me don't get me wrong but i'm gonna appreciate what come with it one way or the other so i see again per huge i see both of their points what i'm saying and when niggas come on here exposing shit people like doodle garbage can only bring up money he gotta call the industry and stuff Man, this is the 48 Laws of Power. I could literally take all his fans right now. He's, bro, he's, he's empty. He can't help nobody with mental health. He can't help nobody with depression. He'll probably just tell them, go get some money. Yo, I see that quoted in somebody's comments. <laughs> Who knew it came from so? <laughs> in fact, though, I mean... I ain't saying DDG can't be deep, but that's not his angle on the internet. So he, hey, I don't think you're going to too much get the video out of DDG sitting down like, let's discuss mental health today. Let's do a mental health check-in. How are you guys feeling? And if he does, his, or if you do ask for advice and he actually addresses it to give you a solution, one of them probably will pertain to get your money up and some of your problems will go away, which could be valid, which could be true. But you can still be on the inside, outside of all of it. He has no genuine connection with anybody, bro. I told y'all, this nigga's... Opinion. <laughs> everybody see it now. The only thing he could think about was money. Bro, how was you so vulnerable and bothered by a motherfucker dropping videos on his third channel with 200,000 subscribers and you have 4 million? Now I see why they say so is so legendary because this man's facial expressions, expressions, demeanor is pure comedy for sure. And again, he making another point again. If your life is not about numbers and it's about core supporters, so may have him there. But to DDG's point, I mess with who I mess with and they mess with me back anybody else is a spectator watcher somebody I aspire or maybe a hater but either way I'm getting the money and I'm getting the views off of y'all that's tough my guy bro you really should retire yo fans see you for what you are these little niggas getting older none of that jury and shit don't matter they getting smarter they like bro this nigga broke his feet broke spiritually he really broke his hell for real he has nothing to offer for nothing all he can do is tell. <laughs> but, hey, I rest my case. Everything I said has come true. Everything I said, the first thing he could think about was money. On a video that wasn't making no money in the first place. I'm glad y'all got a chance to watch it with no ads. Like majority of all my other vids. I cuss in every video. My nigga, it's not possible. I'm talking about selling soul and all this different shit. You think they really gonna pay me for this? <laughs> but, hey. Make sure you like, share, subscribe if you're new. And I'm out, bruh. I'm going to just... All right. So that's Soul's response. Again, I will say valid points were made. But at the same time, DDG did bring up what So brought up, music. He addressed and stood on his talent and his accolades. So, again, kudos to DDG for that. But Soul's point is about things outside of the industry. So, 
I mean, I ain't gonna hold you. That one, it went really too much. That's so's response. I don't feel like, like I said, I don't feel like this is gonna go too much further. Just a little troll back and forth. <laughs> he said he caught the industry on it. <laughs> That's pure comedy. Let me go ahead and pull up DDG's other response video. Like I said, I'm gonna just go ahead and wrap this all together in one. I'm 10 minutes in on this video. Um. You know what? Actually, actually, no. We're 10 minutes in on this video. We're going to stop it right here. I'm going to load up this DDG uh, other video that he posted yesterday. Get straight to it, and we'll be right back. Again, like y'all know, I always say I appreciate y'all for coming through. Make sure y'all comment, like, subscribe. And if you like this video, you're probably going to like this one. I got it this time. <laughs> All right, y'all. Peace.